Does have the option to go for a carry against it. He does go with the cannon. Fallen out of favor after some of the changes to him. And also, also after teams in the West realize they can't actually play well. So waiting up here. One in the river. One on the top lane. Jump now stunned up. The chain CC comes forward. Vizitachi running for his life. First blood gonna drop for the misfit. Spider goes up, comes down. And this is actually one of the first time Chachi gets to really push it out. And Obviously, the Mega Knight disappearing and all in. Far getting aggressive the longer stays in that storm, the more damage is going to do. Hyper Prox being used up, but that's a mini Gnar, that's a squishy Gnar, and that is a dead Gnar. What is Far grabs it. Outside, Vizitachi continues to push forward. Two stacks on the mark of the storm. Three, that's going to be the sun, but the Mega Gnar is on the way in. He's just going to throw him backward. Good disengage for now. Where's the cast from Maxor going to be? Is not available. Flash out from Vizichachi. Decent damage comes forward. Maxor wants to start the dive. Is going to tank up the tower for his ally, his friend. Oh, yet another kill going down for Alfari. Suddenly, this can be early game. Did not manage to land a whole lot of cocoons, but he does succeed. There's a Chachi on the backside, knocking multiple members back into the Syndra. Not going to find the engage quite yet. Power Beetle has been locked up. Max Exile wants it. To safety. That's going to be the kill over to Exile. He's now running forward onto that Syndra. Unafraid. Tides of Blood comes out. But doesn't have the damage to finish it up. Ignar now on the way in as well, just to protect. It's going to be the hook pulled under tower. Pulls out. Ulti going to be interrupted. Hansama coming in. Featherstorm comes out. That's the kill for the Misfits. 80 carry. And uh, yeah, the thing, I think uh, after the pulse, but... Now they're picking their lanes. Sansama and Ikna on top side. Chachi. Nice step on the wall up. How far are you going to... Ooh, double stun and makes it out. Very low, though. Has to respect the potential for an engage here. Going aggressive. Hansama could be in trouble. May not have the ultimate after that play in the mid lane. Still going to get one. Now Ignar's on the back side out of nowhere. Can't buffer that one. Now pulled back. Tries to predict the hook. Still going to be Xerxes going down. That is the double kill. And in the end, Misfits are going to walk away unscathed in the tower play. And yeah. Then, yeah, at this point, Exile can really start playing aggressive right now. We're going to get a fight. Hill saying, actually gonna get interrupted there. Couldn't quite pull him over the wall. Looks like there wasn't enough space. Oh, was there like a snare from Ansama landing at uh, the same time? Probably a CC chain means he's the Chachi trying to pull it out. Maxlor is there to steal it, but if they can force the Gragas to take it, they'll be in a happy coincidence. Is the getting knocked forward, trying to make his way out of the fight, throwing the blue buff onto him. Hey, you want it, you can have it. Sam needs to grab blue buff. it. <laughs> but they're gonna get the kill in the end, so, and now you starts taking over. Misfits around the mid lane. Let's see a uh, classic <laughs> fight around the mid lane, boys. This is Chachi moving forward. Power Beagle could be the one in trouble, but Hillsang pulled back into Team Exile on the way in, looking for the team fight. Alfari now running for his life. Exile hungry for a little bit more. Pools up. Tides of Blood comes out. Maxlor on the menu. Now pulling back. Power Beagle trying to flash to safety. Samix ace in the hole. Snipes him down. And I know Kelsey Mose is already retweeting her old tweet. Impossible to steal in theory, Hansama. Not going to get it. <laughs> Unicorns of Love get the Baron they after a bloody threat. Pulling over the wall, that's how we do! Chain CC comes in, where is the Vladimir though? Can the team get this going? Mizutachi trying to run for his life. He will get shielded up, he will make it out, but Samix is in trouble. Power Eagle takes a moment to consider before he goes any deeper. Now Exile is moving forward. QSS comes out, Hansama trying to survive. Featherstorm comes out, the shutdown in. Exile, no chance to escape, but Unicorns of Love, they're on the tower. Inhibitor is in their sights. Mizutachi backs off and just comes right back to the fight. Maxlor now running for his life. Third proc on Hyper means Vizichachi can chase down anyone he wants, but Power of Evil may have enough damage to block this out. No, Hillisang not going to let it happen. Samix going to grab a kill. Unicorns Love are going off. Alfari doing what he can, but the Caitlyn is too strong. They're going for more right now to get another kill on Ignar. They will get this in him at least. They're actually looking for the turrets. Samix moving forward. They have the Baron buff backing them up. They can get one more tower. We look at the death timers. 13 seconds for Hansama. He's the quickest one to respawn. Unfortunately, the cannon creep being so far away. Yeah, makes they will it just difficult. take one. They just take one tower to take another one yeah. team. And we're starting to see why Cannon has not been the biggest top lane pick. Wait, he's doing it again. Can they stun him before he goes into Minionar? He's not going to get anybody. Finally, cast the curse. I love it. <laughs> it does not work the first time. Try, try again. There is the feather storm. Exile locked up for a brief moment. We'll have the blood rush charging. Now he's going to try to pull. Not going to get the chance. Misfits getting a couple kills back, stopping Unicorns of Love for pushing for anything Ignor more. Ignar and Maxlo show up, maybe turn it around. They do have one spotting Ignar now. Chachi with Meganar soon. Bye bye. Goes over the wall. Meganar ready. Visit Chachi flash as well. Keep your eyes. Oh, on Hill was saying apparently. Afari running in, trying to get the kill, trying to make this one out. He's going to be in trouble. Will get a kill onto the support, but trades his life. That's Loon, but you can see uh, Unicorns looking for fights. Oh, Hill was saying. Where's the ultimate? Can he get a disengage out? It doesn't look like there's going to be an option. Hillisang has been picked off. UOL, do they still want the fight? Exile Samix, Vizichachi moving forward, waiting on that Mega Nar. Vizichachi running in, has it available, but no flash means it's going to be difficult. Wallop comes up, but the slicing Maelstrom will stun him back in return. He has been pulled back. Samix is going to take him out. That's the one-for-one one exchange. 
Looks out, hoping to fall some much damage. It's Max Lore. Megan on the way in. Don't let him Body do slam. it. He has flash. Not gonna get it in the end. That's the Baron for the Unicorns of Love. Now thrown back to the Team Exiles in the middle of everything, and they are deleting the Misfits, but Han Samo remains untouched. The Unbreakable buys a bit of time, but massive advantage to the Unicorns of Love, and now Far 8 finds Dead. their win condition in the end. Now Bizuchachi running forward. This could be the final fight. Now moving in as well. Locked up. Shut down. Goodbye, power of evil. The Unicorns of Love are now looking to break that inhibitor, and they may take the base in the end, but the health bars are low. Will they take the fight? Charges Meganar is ready now. He didn't have it before when he engaged. He just wanted to start a fight onto the No Flash Syndra. Gets hooked in. Pull back. Silence. Locked up for a brief moment. Alt is not going to connect. Alfari on the side looking for a little bit of damage. Slicing Maelstrom and the Flash available, but will just get deleted if he runs into that team. Not that one. Don't want to pull Vizachachi in. Nice stun for Power of Evil. But a poke Samix caught out. Unbreakable comes in and interrupts the fight. Mizuchachi goes in. The Feather Caller not going to be enough. Now looking for a little bit more. Oh, the the team. They're peeling back. Alfari and the rest of the team have grouped up. The stun is not going to connect. They may have gotten the inhibitor tower, but they are set to lose the fight. Samix alive and well. Misfits hungry for buttons. Oh, he gets it. The hook. Goodbye, Caitlyn. No. Samix still alive, holding on as long as he can, but the shutdown coming in for Misfits. <laughs> and they barely hold on to life. Yeah, once again, when we praise the Unicorns of Love, then suddenly Misfits oh, win the fight. Oh, no. In the end, worth for the Unicorns because they got that top lane. Top. For the Unicorns of Love to take that top lane inhibitor. And there's not a lot left to say. Unicorns of Love, no structures left in front of them. They're just waiting for double super minions in every lane. They're just waiting to walk it down, but they may go aggressive for the fight here. Nice disengage comes in. Vizichachi takes a little bit of poke. Exile on the front lines. Flash forward. Ooh. Does get the ultimate Han Sama bringing out the Feather Storm. There's no bomb to block it up. So Exile. He's gonna have to go gold, but meanwhile, Samix just gonna throw down the auto attacks. He can just hit the Nexus, but he doesn't care. He wants a few more kills to pad those stats. Unicorns of Love close it out just so cleanly. And man, Misfits, remember rule number one. You don't fight them in that mid lane.